Kelly here for Midnight Madness TV and we are in Nottingham for none other than the Midnight Madness semi-finals. We've been all over the UK and now it's come down to the uh, semi-final round of course and the She's Got Next competition has started. These girls are playing hard and playing fast to make sure they secure their place in the Midnight Madness finals. It's fun. First of all, I'm trying to have fun playing against the girls I think it's playing in London and playing with some of the Loughborough lot, against some of the Loughborough lot. Yeah. I don't know, we're much different talent. Like, I played with a lot of these people before and I'm, I'm used to having a lot of them like, on my team. But playing against them, like, it's different. It's hard, but like, it's good competition. And I've got the girls who have made it through to the finals. Hello, lovely ladies, how are we? Hey, I'm going to go to Amber Charles, number one spot. You must be over the moon. Yes, I am. It's a little bit crazy, but yeah, I was not expecting my name to be called number one, but that's how the stats go, I guess. <laughs> We're holding the last show in proof for these guys to earn themselves their spot on the elite court right here in Nottingham for the Midnight Madness semi final. As you can see behind me, the under 20s are lining up and they're ready to go. Don't tell me, tell me, tell me. Um, you must be ready to play. Yeah, of course. Every day, all day. Come on, let's go. But Josh Palmer is certain that he's gonna get his ticket to the finals, aren't you? I'm definitely certain, you know. I had like an Avengers. I never got picked for Midnight Madness like the last two years I did it. So this summer I said, you know what, I'm definitely going to get both tickets and go, go through to play for finals. I've got some of the under 20s finalists that have made it through to the finals happening next week. Rosano, you've done very well and you've got that finalist ticket. Very nice ticket right there. How do you feel? Uh, I feel all right. He feels all right, he's feeling more than all right. Emmanuel, tell me about it. You're the only guy representing Manchester right now. Um, you must be very proud. Yeah, I feel good, because obviously last year I didn't, I didn't get a golden ticket, so for me to win it this year, it feels good. Yeah. <laughs> so Swazi McCanny is here for the Midnight Madness semi-finals all night. Can I just say, this is like a basketball event you've never seen before. Why? Because through those doors, we've got a cinema room, we've got a game zoning room, we've got a chill out lounge, we've got everything. Look, see, cinema this way. Think love and basketball might be playing. But let's see who's gonna be here. See, they think they can disguise it because it's, a, it's a, a, a mirror with a pretty lady in there. <laughs> but let's see. Oh, hey. See what's going on in here. Some people are clearly trying to have a little snooze whilst other guys are getting that work. Um, Dotton, Dotton is on here with Michael Federer. What do these guys need to make it through the night? They need to have a lot of stamina, that's for sure. They've got to be real smart, that's the most important thing. Um, and really kind of not pace yourself, but just be smart when you're going to be using your energy. No point in running up and down, running up and down and getting dead tired. And by the time you know you win a couple of games, you know, you're know you dead on your feet. So you've got to be a little bit smart. Obviously, you have to win games. So at some point, you're going to have to go all out. Uh, but be smart about how you use your energy. Be efficient. Be efficient. And uh, we are at the semi-finals all night, but it's no longer night, it is now morning. It's like seven o'clock in the morning because we fall through the night and I've got some of the over 20s ticket winners, finalists. I've got LVC, Ed Lucas and Matthew Bryan and Manning. Hello guys. Hello, that just made it a lot easier. So uh, Mr. Ed Lucas, you're back in town. How do you feel? I feel very, very tired. I mean, I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to play in this event like always. And I'm yeah, just ready to go to the finals and show up.
basketball and entertainment and to keep up to date with all the madness, there's only one thing to do, subscribe to our YouTube channel.